We're here with Victor Ramden, but we're not here to talk about poker. Victor, can you tell us a little bit about the charity you're involved with? Well, I can start talking now and I might not finish until tomorrow, but let me make it very briefly. Um, uh, it's Kiana Watch. Uh, Kiana Watch. Um, it's a small charity from my country where I was born in Georgetown, Guyana. We're in South America, right next to Venezuela and Brazil. And once a year, I try to solicit all my poker friends to go along with me and share some of the experience in working for poor people, poor kids, poor people. And it's something that I look forward to every year. So you actually fly down to Guyana and help the citizens? Yes, what we do, like once a year after the World Series is over, I solicit as much people, not just to go for a joyride, just to work their ass off, yeah. help out and give back something. And what do you guys do when you're down there? What we do there, we solicit a team of doctors from the U.S. We take a lot of medication with us, and we go and treat people for all kinds of sickness. Our ultimate goal is to find kids or people or who are badly in need who can't afford surgeries, is to find kids that need surgeries so that we can make a difference in somebody else's life. Most of these kids, are, if they don't have surgery, they simply die. It's like this year, we just came back and we got 21 kids in need of surgery right now. So I'm hoping that I can win something big this year so I can probably take, the, take care of all of them myself. So or, you donate your, some of your tournament winnings to the children? Um, yeah, so far I've done close to like 240 so far. My career, everything I won, about 240000 towards that charity. And what responses do you get from other poker players when you ask them to come down there and help you out? It's just phenomenal. I mean, I, I haven't found one guy to say one bad word or, you know, just mere thought of... You can just ask a few players who have gone down there with me, Phil Ivey, Barry Greenstein, or Lederer. It was just an honor to have these guys just join us and help my little cause. I'm just trying to, not specifically only Guyana, I just wish I can get all poker players to do something else other than playing poker, do something else with their time, give back some charity, one or the other, right here in the U.S., or wherever the country they're from, they can do something to make a difference in the world. And it's so good for the poker industry, for people to see poker players giving back. There's so much money involved in the industry, and these people really need it. My God, I've heard of some money, um, big money in the, in the poker world. If everyone can just give a quarter percent, uh, it'll make us, the world a better place, because there's so much poor people or poor kids can get her help in one way or the other, it's like Barry Greenstein, does such a hell of a Absolutely. job with Children Incorporated. I just wish there were other organizations, just not just Guyana Watch or Children Incorporated, many other, that people can just go out and give back something, just give back something from what they have earned. And what type of responses do you get from the citizens of Guyana when you go down there and oh give God. them the needed it, medical it's, care? It's unbelievable. It's just that you need to experience that feeling once in your life to understand like I said, not just Guyana, I'm sure you can go to Africa, All over anywhere, the world. any part of the world, there is so much thanks and appreciation deep down inside because some of these people, it's a simple, imagine there's a kid needs surgery, there is no surgeries available in the country and we can make a difference. So that child is going to live a normal life again. So that's what I, my hope and my wish is like to win more and more money so every year I can do something more and more make a difference in somebody's life. That's great, Victor. Thank you very much and good luck with that. Thanks again.